Guys, I'm Rich. And I'm Carson. And today we are going to be doing the thousand degree sword challenge. Now I know we're a little behind on this, but we live in Pennsylvania. And we gotta do it the right way with really messy stuff, so we have to wait until we get a nice day outside. I apologize now for the, for the wind blowing, the audio quality. We wanna get this, we wanna do this challenge so bad, but it's a little windy out, so we're, we're just gonna have to deal with it and see if we can clean it up later. But here it is, 1,000 degree sword challenge. All right, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna get our torches ready. And we have our nice sword set up and ready to go. And I am the cameraman because it is not good for kids to control blow torches. Yeah, I know, I'm a little bit shaky with the camera. And now we just wait until it gets hot. Yep. Alright guys, you can't really tell, but the sun is shining on it, but it's really freaking hot right now. So I'm going to get my gloves so I don't burn myself. And we're going to take the sword over to the table where we will do our first victim, Mr. Chocolate Bunny. Now we were going to do... Okay. Go close up so you can see. It's melting the whole thing. That bunny had a fall. Ooh, it's smoking. Oh, wow. Ugh, it's hard to push him down. Oi! And we just made our chocolate. There we go. Now, Mr. It smells like s'mores. Oh, that smells good. Hmm, guys, it smells like s'mores. You can see all this. Burning the chocolate. Hmm. Nice. Wow. On to the next. It kind of looks like. It smells like s'mores, but it kind of looks like a steak. It kind of looks like a turd. On to the next. All right, here we go. Round two. We're going to destroy Mr. Football. Please don't explode. Oh, that thing is smoking. Ooh, that's so satisfying. It kind of looks like bread. I'll get a view where it's not smoke. <coughs> oh. How, how does it smell? Stinky hot. Ooh. Oh, that smell is disgusting. That's why I'm wearing my fire protection. I almost burned my hand. Ugh. Guys, that does not smell good. Ugh. Cut right through. It kind of looks like bread on the inside. Buttered bread. 
that one, so. And football is dead. Okay, our next two victims are Senor Silly Putty and Squidward. Silly Putty's first. Oh, I'm first. Jeez. It's hard to hold it. Ah. Oh. We got the Silly Putty out. Ooh, it's milk. It's just milk. It's too slippery. Oh, that looks like bubble gum. Oh. Yeah, it doesn't smell like it. Yeah, I don't know. And send your squitter. Oh. oh, he is. Oh, he is. He's actually not cutting so easy. There it is. There's the hot spot. Oh. Ugh. Actually, I didn't do much. That's Squidward's head. You guys, oh, oh my god, that's disgusting. Squidward's actually not cutting easy. See, as you can see, there's so much smoke, it's hard to cut them. So that is the aftermath of Squidward. And I'm silly buddy, it's just going to be Okay, our next vi victim is Mr. Cotton Candy Boy. It is jelly bean cotton candy. Oh. Oh. Ooh, look at how it melted. That looks good. It doesn't. I'd eat it if it didn't have Squidward remnants all over it. <laughs> Look at how it melts, that's awesome. It kind of looks like there's honey inside of that, guys. Mmm, that smells good. It smells like at the fair when they, when they make it fresh. Cool, yeah, so. Now he's gonna try cutting the actual tin, which he did get part of it. Yeah, okay, he's getting through. And this is an unsharpened blade, by the way. Yeah. Oh. It's just the heat going through. Oh. That's all right. Next, we are going to cut 36 or 48 crayons. Oh. You guys probably can't see that because of the shade and the smoke. Oh, that was so good. Ow! It squirted on me. Oh, by the way, that cotton candy like stuck to the table. You guys should be using it. Ow! Try this at home, kids, without an adult. And even adults can screw it up. It's like water. That, that one right there got in there. Hey guys, you just went into the bathroom. You got the water right there. Water is right there. Okay, and now we are going to cut a half gallon of milk. Half, half, yeah, that's what I just said. Put it on the back up just in case. Oh! Hopefully, I didn't miss that action, but oh my god. It looks like, oh my god. It kind of looks like my dad threw up like during the Sarstrama challenge. Oh! Oh, jeez!
Now that was pretty cool, but yeah, uh, R.I.P. Milk. Yeah, now we're gonna go to the next thing. Okay, the next thing we are going to cut is a can of Dr. Thunder. Not cutting. It is. It's not cutting, guys. Uh, well. Oh god, okay, yeah, that's gonna explode very soon. Ah. Oh, okay, it's exploded. Oh, okay, I got that on camera. That blew up nicely. I good, good, good thing I got that on camera. Okay, now we're going to cut a giant two liter bottle of soda. And now I'm nervous because this is gonna explode. Oh! Guys, that just almost squirted me. I wish I got that on camera. So it's cold now. There we go. Okay, that's. That's the cola gone. Not at all. Cold. It shot all over the canoe. Oh, oh, it shot everywhere. All right, guys, that was the thousand degree sword challenge. Uh, I hope you found it entertaining. It was pretty entertaining for us to watch some of this stuff melt. This for the people. Oh. Okay, so I guess that was the prank. I was wondering why we needed a bowl of water out here, and now I know, and why there was ice in it. Mm. All right, so I guess I got pranked a little bit. That's what he got for the bean boozled. All right, but anyway, that was the thousand degree sword challenge. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, pretty satisfying watching some of this stuff melt. The smell of the chocolate and cotton candy is pretty cool. But yeah, if you like the video, like it. Uh, be sure to subscribe, uh, comment, more challenge videos that you want us to do. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And uh, until next time, don't do drugs, kids. <laughs>